Hey guys, as you can see, I'm at the Leatherman store in Portland, Oregon. It's right next to the airport. So let's go inside and take a look. And as you can see, if you're into multi-tools, this is like heaven for you. So they got the Mutt. This one's pretty awesome. If you have an AR-15, this probably comes in really handy. You can use this as a hammer too, but um, if you miss the nail, that would really hurt your hand if the nail went into your hand. I'm not a big fan of pounding things with the small hammers. But I guess if you had to, that, that's what you got. Man, this thing has all kinds of stuff on it. What is this? This is a punch right there. It's got a saw. I'm doing this one-handed. There's a saw in there. You got your straight edge. Oh, actually, it's a combo. Serrated and straight edge. You got a flathead and a Phillips in there tucked away. Oh, it's got a little pin so you can slide it out. That's cool. And then there's another, another uh, what you call it? I think it's a Torx on the other side. And then obviously it has a set of pliers on the inside. That's cool. All right, check this out. Super Tool 300 EOD. Combo blade. Oh, it's got a saw on there. There's like a metal cutting saw. That's pretty slick. What else we got in here? Flathead, large flathead, all. We got the uh, Phillips, another flathead. What is this one in here? Saw. So this thing is a C4 punch. I guess you could poke a hole in a, a block of C4 and then put the picture, uh, picture uh, wires in there. Super Tool 300, pretty slick, pretty standard stuff. Same thing as the EOD, but it doesn't have the uh, doesn't have the C4 punch. Surge, very cool. This one has all kinds of stuff on it, man. You know what I like about these is all the tools are on the outside, serrated, plain edge, scissors. This one has some nice big scissors on them. Nice and scissors. Pretty slick. Very nice. Those are big scissors too. And then on the inside. Oh, what is this? On the inside. I get it. Oh, there we go. So this one has flat, flat head, can opener, and then a whole bunch of other ones. Flat heads and all. Very cool. Aha, this is the one that I have. Leatherman Wave. I love this thing. I have it with me here on this trip, but I, I forgot to bring it to the store. But yeah, I love this thing. I had a full review on that one. And then here's the charge. Oh, this is the titanium. This is the uh, aluminum. That's nice. 140. Here's the titanium. 170 bucks. That is nice. Very cool. All that. Scissors in there. Screwdriver. And then over here. Straight edge. Combo. Oh, I got the belt cutter right there. That's cool. Very nice. This one has the saw there, and a file, charge, titanium, that is nice, rebar, pretty cool, pretty standard affair, what does this one have, um, file, replaceable cutters, what else we got? What is it? Sidekick. This is kind of cool. It's got a humongous belt clip. Saw. Oh, this is uh, cool. They're all accessible on the outside. There's a saw. What is this? 
coinage. <laughs> and then, oh, this is spring loaded. Another saw, a file, can opener. It's on this side. Phillips and flathead. This is cool though, it's, it's actually spring loaded. I like that. That's actually really cool. All right, so over here is the freestyle. It's nice and compact. Small. Very cool. Oh, close it up. It's tiny. Makes a good little EDC carry here. It's got a skeletonized combo edge. It's very cool. Oh, so over here, Skeletal. That is cool. Oh, this one has carbon fiber in it. Look at that. It's like carbon fiber. It's got the uh, D ring on there. Everything is skeletonized on this one. Is it allowed to open? Very cool. You got your Phillips and your, oh, it's got two different size Phillips on here. And here's a two different size flatheads on there. And then on this side, you got a belt clip, it's like a pocket clip. And then over here is your plain edge. That's pretty slick. 90 bucks. Leap. What is a leap? Let's take a look at a leap. Oh, it's a same deal, but it's mostly plastic instead of metal. And then you got, oh, look at that. It's got a saw, Phillips, flathead, tweezers. Oh, look at that. It's got tweezers on there and a little small flathead. And the last one is scissors. Wow, that's kind of cool. I like that. And you got the Style CS and the Micro. These are awesome. Seen those before. All right, so that's a quick run through of all the Leatherman tools. Let's see their flashlights. They actually got flashlights over here too. Check this out. I'm not familiar with these at all. I'm not going to go through all the specs on this. There's a, they just go on forever. But I will look at the L the uh, lumens. 450 lumens. It seems like it would be a lot brighter. You got two dots on this one. Look at that. These these lenses are nuts. Whoa. 400 lumens. This thing must be like a mini floodlight. Very cool. Look at this. This is like the old uh, mag. It's like the same size as a mag light. You can beat somebody down with that thing. 650 bucks. Look at that thing. That is nuts. 3,000 lumens. This thing is three thousand lumens this one's 1600 lumens this is definitely search and rescue type stuff over here climbing camping very cool this is like for going oh waterproof down to 60 meters that's cool you got a easy reach little lever and then over here just got little edc lights just enough to get by what is this this must be a magnet oh it's automotive Oh, I see. It's got a magnet, so you can put this anywhere you want. That's kind of cool. It's called the automotive. And then little tiny ones here, just for your pocket. Just enough to get by. And then they have all kinds of accessories, spare batteries, 18650 rechargeables. Just everything you need. It's, it, it's like a one-stop shop in here. Check these out. This is called the Jam. It's like a carabiner, but a carabiner with a bunch of tools on it. Grind, I guess that's for uh, skateboarders. Mako, which is just another tool. Very cool. And they got even little tiny ones here too. Little tiny tools. Look at that, it's like a little deer ring with, with tools on it. Z-Rex, that's cool. That looks like some type of... Uh, Oxygen tank, carbide, glass breaker. So this is like an EMT tool right here. That's really cool for you EMT guys out there. Very cool. Oh, here's their knives. I have one of these. So some of these knives have tools built into them. 
Flathead, Phillips, Blacked Out. Oh, there goes the uh, EMT shears, the Raptor. Comes with a holster. Very cool. And there goes that um, EMT tool right there. Very cool. Tim Leatherman original prototypes. That is wild. He actually made these in his garage, I guess. The very first prototypes. That is crazy. Basically, those turned into these. Very cool. Got all kinds of replacement parts here too. Anything, everything. Oh wait, here we go. This is what I need right here. Bit kit, 21 piece. The least I could do is buy me some parts. So I'm gonna buy this. All right guys, so that was my tour of the Leatherman shop. I got this uh, replacement screwdriver that I broke. They gave it to me for free, but I ended up buying a whole kit that had one of these anyway. But um, I ended up buying a leather case for my Wave. And I also got a entire tool kit for my Leatherman Wave. So there you go. Uh, if you're in Portland, you got to stop by the Leatherman shop. It's near the airport. You can stop by here on the way to the airport. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Leave a comment below. Tell me what you think about Leatherman. Like, share, and subscribe.